Hey folks, and welcome back to Warlords of Draenor. So, let's get back into it. And, yeah, I just stopped that after the end of the last recording. I was tired. I was like, ah, fuck it. I need some sleep. Normally I wouldn't do that, but, ah, I, I was wrecked. But at least this time, I've got some cola. Sweet, delicious cola. Ooh, I never knew that. Using Dungeon Finder with a group of friends grants you additional bonus gold. And this episode is being co-commentated by Michael Fackley. So yeah, I didn't even mess with the garrison stuff. I just was like, ah, oh, fuck it. I'm tired. And like I said before, I wouldn't do that normally, but... Oh, cool. Some garrison stuff. Teaches a, fo a follower the Hearthstone Pro trait. Turns an ordinary follower into a tactical genius. Okay, that's kind of cool. Well, I'll head back to the garrison in a bit. Let's do a few quests here. Uh, I've got this prototype shredder uh, operating on most cylinders. Boy, will they be surprised when you stomp them with their own machine. Can't wait to watch you from the safety of the observer copter. Let's get in and break some faces. Okay, first ability. Electrostatic distortion. Inflicts major damage to the enemies near the lightning orb. Death from above. Inflicts nature damage to enemies at the target location. Knocks them back. Ah, I need to be over here. There's a few ways in. None actually from the north. It's weird. I'm just walking past and a toad tries to murder me. <laughs> you got an auto attack. Nice. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> it's cool. This is I, I. I like this mech. Iron Brute is dead. I'm gonna be honest. I am exceedingly glad that they didn't actually have this operational when I was, you know, before I got it. Because wouldn't that be my, somewhat terrifying? <sighs> Who am I trying to kill now? They're all dying around me. I'm getting confused. Oh, hell. Can I be honest? Even this is actually extremely fun. Ooh, that's cool. That attack is actually pretty badass. I just prefer this because it's more reliable. Hey folks in the back, sorry about that. Uh, the West, he started barking. Okay, also in case anyone is going to be an idiot, uh, that was a reference to my dog. The, you know, the Michael Fackley comment? Yeah, Michael Fackley isn't actually here. That may be, have to be made clear for some people. Enemies eliminated. The murder has been detected. Warning, warning. Ooh, she's the one who made this. Okay, that's a very nice maze. Vehicle override. Uh, vehicle control overridden. Returning to creator. Engineering her demise. Let's see how you do when you don't have a machine of my design at your disposal. 
Oh, that's such a great mag. I suppose that's why you, you took it off me. Damn it. I, 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 I can't use the... Garrison ability. It just suddenly stopped. Claiming I'm too far away. Jess would stop moving. It's just I hated being in the background. Also, also, I'm also glad the Mac is significantly weaker. Like, seriously. Oh, she's down. Did she die twice there? That's what it looked like. I'm gonna be honest, I'm mildly disappointed about that mech. It would have been brilliant if I could keep it. But I know they wouldn't allow that to happen. Same with like the um the artifact that allows you to summon in the the artifact from Grand. But uh, it would have just been awesome, damn it. Also, a random mailbox. <sighs> Enemies up the wazoo today. Right. The eel is still trying to murder me, so I can't get on my horse. Or, well, dr Dread Raven. Ooh. I've actually been thinking, I've actually been playing a bit of um, Serious Sam recently, getting very tempted in rec actually recording a bit. I plan on doing it at some stage, but uh, it just, it gets frustrating at certain times with certain enemies' abilities. One enemy can pick you off and slow you down, pick you off and shake you a little. And unless you're in a good, a good position, you're pretty much fucked, as, well, they don't do much damage, the other enemies will, and it's really annoying. The enemy, the screams of our enemies wash over me. The people of Turan are avenged. Yeah, I think his anger is getting the best of him. Well, then again, again, what do you expect of Captain Genocide? Hey folks, and I'm back. Sorry about that. Shot rock must have fallen into the hands of the Iron Horde. It is time again for me to get my hands bloody. We will, we will tell Khadigar we are ready to enter the city and take back what is rightfully ours. Let us make haste to Khadigar and the others. Alright. Is that anything else going to be said? No. In which case, I'm just gonna ride ahead. No point in waiting on them. They're slow as fuck. Ooh, I have a wanted quest to turn in over there. Though, that can wait for a bit. Hmm. I, do, I have to say, I do like the Drain Eye buildings. They look cool. So they look a lot different to the Drain Eye buildings I'm used to, from, well, Outlands or, you know, wherever. So they certainly are have some resemblances, what with the crystal architecture and whatnot, and the purples, but the, the, they're j there's a fair few differences that, I don't know, just seem off. Also, here's Dortan of the Frost Wolf Orcs. And Draca. These are Troll's parents. They are presumably a bit different in this alternate universe as well. This is like set up 20 years before a certain point in WoW. Oh, this is set back before the Horde invaded Azeroth. So, this is, that's quite a bit back. 
consider like between Rattle Witch King and Cataclysm, there, there's three years. The game, I find, isn't great at showing the passage of time like that. You can't, feel, I think you kind of need to read the lore books outside it. Exploring my home world has proven more dangerous than I hope than I hoped. I like his armor. It's pretty cool. And there's also a horde of insignias everywhere. You've done great work. Ooh, I can talk with these two. I fear Mirad is becoming consumed by his anger. Yeah, he is. Like, I mean, he's earned a new title for me, Captain Genocide. If anyone thinks I'm making light of it, I'm not. I don't mean to. Seriously, I, that's not my point. <sighs> You've done great work with Murad, Urel, and Taylor. I can't say that name. To stop the Iron Horde, we must overcome prejudice and work together, if only for this purpose. Horde, alliance, past, present, all meaningless in the face of this enemy. Will we take Shatrak together, or die trying? Well, if, we, if I die, I just run back to my corpse. Problem solved. If we ever repel the Iron Horde from Shatrak, it will be a, major, a great... Hey, folks in the back. Uh, dog was moving around again. If we were able to repel the Iron Horde from Shabrat, it would be a great blow to their strategy if we managed to take out their super weapon as well. Well, what, do I just stroll in or... I assume so. I tr that's why I talked to the Kadigar, because I assumed I had to. But now, it seems I just have to walk to over here. Nope, sorry, wrong way. It would just help greatly in my defense retaking Shatrat if I know what direction to run. It's kind of hard to lead a battle if, well, you run in the wrong direction. All allied forces under guidance of the Archmage Khadgar are ready to begin the battle for Shatrat. Ooh, Gazlo. I've seen him elsewhere, though I don't remember where. I'll be honest, maybe it was the Goblin Serpent Zone? There's him. Cheers, Commander. We found this Iron Star just here, just waiting to be repaired. And Glasgow over there has been helping me fix it up. It should be ready for action when you are. Kadigar said he would meet you down there by the harbour with the others. A wee bit jealous that you get to roll over some Iron Horde in this tank. Thanks. We'll meet them at the docks. I can get into the Iron Star and roll it around. What a way to die. I'm just intentionally rolling over as many as I can. Because this is fun. Brutal, but hey, they're pricks. I was really hoping this could jump. Also, if it could move faster, that would be nice. Like, seriously, this, uh, this moves slowly. Also, some of them are saying for the Burning Blade. That is a, a clan, though I always thought it was merely a cult worship, who, that worshipped demons in WoW. Uh, solely orcs. Um, I never knew these could be occupied. Let's hope my character's not like, just bouncing around on the inside. That would be awkward. Let's see if I can... Oh, I was hoping I could run someone over. Damn it. Why did that have to happen? This is why I can't have nice things. We m now must face the Iron Horde. Divine Shield. Oh, that makes him give up. Good, good. 
We, we now must face the Iron Horde fleet. They have a powerful weapon aboard a battleship just off the coast. I know spells that can clear the way, but it'll take all my focus to channel it. During my incantation, I will be vulnerable. It will be up to you and our allies to protect me. Gain your spell. I will protect you. The Iron Horde have amassed on the docks. Protect Khadgar while he prepares his spell to neutralize something. The harbor. Apparently, uh, Yurel, her, um, Avenging Wrath only lasts like three seconds. I remember someone tweeting about that. Still, she has some other abilities that I'm really jealous of. Actually, I've never checked here. This doesn't say if I get a new. So I'm going to assume I don't. Probably should toss out a few more heals. Ooh, time stop. I just noticed over here what Khadgar was actually casting. And it's nearly done. That is very nice. A uh, blade masters are actually from Warcraft Three. Well, they were there. There's uh, Grom, for example, is a blade master. They have a variety of abilities. One being whirlwind. Ooh, radiant light. Oh, I lost it, and I got it back. Feared frost wolf, radiant light. And if I wanted, I could call in a barrage. The Iron Horde's favorite weapon is in the harbor. Take over the ship. Your allies will Your allies will work to keep Black Hand out of your way on the flagship. Frozen in time. Nice. Ooh, and I've nearly reached the next re uh, level of uh, reputation. It is you who will make Draenor burn. It is you who must be oh. I will not. I will not slay so many innocent people. Innocent. It, it is you who made Draenor burn. It is you who must be stopped. Um. Yes, I will see Draenor burn. You traitor will not. We'll hold Black Hand off. Okay, Black Hand's a prick. But it it sounds like Doomhammer is turned on him. The enemy battle, uh, teleport me to the ship. Yeah, Doomhammer has turned on him. Uh, Doomhammer, uh, I don't actually know much about the character. Uh, all I knew is he... <laughs> nice. All I knew about him was that he was the leader of the Horde at some stage, or a very important character in, in the leadership of it, and he went missing uh, when Troll was growing up, or beforehand. I'm not entirely sure of the exact details, but he reappeared and was told, and was there for a few battles uh, that Troll was involved with in freeing uh, uh, orcs from concentration camps, or what we call that, and and he dies on the assault of the keep of the human in charge of those camps. And he passes the leadership on to Troll. Beyond that, I have no idea about the camp guy. Uh, but like, I have no idea was he a prick or not, what, or anything about his character. All I can remember is... He, he carks it. <laughs> Not really the most flattering thing to remember someone by, but there you go. Yeah, this guy isn't getting out of. <laughs> I'll take you with me! <laughs> they need your help with Black Hand. I, uh, oh, thanks. Why didn't you just kill him? You're a very powerful mage. You will 
Morand, and Duartan need your help on the flagship, well, I can't will not go down without a fight. If I'd known that's going to happen, then I would save my... Damn it.